Hey guys, what's going on? It's Man on Twitch here. We're back with some more Dead by Daylight. Oh, let me just quickly turn off my fan. Um, and we're up against a Wraith, so that's always fun. Uh, perk loadout is Spine Chill, Sprint Burst, Sabotage, and Self Care, as you can see in the bottom right hand corner. I'm gonna go with Sabotage this hook. I don't like this position. Oh, looks like we're gonna be fine. Um, are we in sheltered woods? Because if so, that is very bad. I think we are. This feels very sheltered woodsy. I don't know why, but the last four games I've played today have been on this map. I don't know why this map just loves me, though. Bit. I hope he doesn't go to that hook. And he's going to that hook. Okay. Oh, no, he's going to this hook. No, he's going to that hook. Nope, stop, stop, stop. I'm gonna grab him before he can even attempt to escape. There we go. So that's. Oh, he's looking at us? He's not. Alright, I think he's after him. That was very successful. So I think that guy's a new player because you saw he instantly went for the uh, attempt to escape, which is really bad. Um. Now he actually has a second time on the hook. I hope he presses space, because I'm willing to go get 1,500 more points. I don't know about you guys. I'm going to hide here. He might walk by. Oh, I might as well do it. Dude, run, run, you're so fucking dumb, holy fuck you, you fucking Jake, I fucking hate people like that, that guy deserves to fucking burn, I wouldn't have taken a fucking hit if he wasn't such a fucking dumbass, god I fucking hate people like that, oh whatever, I still got the fuck lot of EXP from it. Now I'm fucked though, because this guy's a fucking idiot. Oh my god. We're gonna have to go here. Still chasing me. He knows that the other dumbass isn't worth saving. This is why Sheltered Woods is also the worst map in the game for survivors. There's no pallets anywhere, there's nothing to juke on. There's shit all. But, I think this guy's an idiot. Oh, nope. Spoke too soon. Alright, alright, we might be good. Yo, did you see that though? That fucking Jake got me hit. Like, what an asshole. There's no need to block the fucking pallet, let the last person go, and don't be a dumbass. Yeah, you better die. You don't deserve to live, asshat. People like that piss me off, especially since I'm risking saving them. But it's alright, we got so much XP from it. Well, it's off to a bad start, but that's every sheltered woods map for you, or every sheltered woods round. Um... As long as we get enough to... I think we're actually already at enough so we don't derank. Because they, uh, if you didn't know, they implemented a new patch. So between seven and 10,000 points, you will no longer derank. Um, so as long as we get 7k, we don't derank. And we're, I'm pretty sure we already hit it. Because we're three quarters of two bars. That's 3,750. Yeah, we're at like 8k points right now. We're really close to uh, a pip as well. We just need some objective or altruism. Because our boldness is max now. Well, fortunately, that uh, super bad player did not get us killed. Got us hit, though, which gave us some survival XP, I guess. But I'd rather just not have a chance of dying. Oh, yeah, this is the hook I was starting on. <sighs> that was intense. 
Like, by the way, if you're ever the first person over a pallet, never throw the pallet down prematurely. Look behind you, check if your team's there, teammate's there, because if he is, let him throw down the pallet, because if you throw down the pallet, first off, you're going to for sure get him hit. Sometimes you'll even get him killed, because if it hit registers, um, as soon as you, uh, as soon as you throw down a, a hit as a, um, a killer into a pallet or a wall or something, it'll give you that cooldown instead of a successful attack. It'll count as a, a successful attack on a object, so a missed attack, um, instead of counting as a successful attack on the survivor, which have really big cooldowns when you hit a survivor. But when you hit just anything, they have a really small cooldown because it means you messed up. So, if he hits you and the pallet, then you're getting your teammate killed like a hundred percent of the time because he'll be able to hit you, you'll go over the pallet, and you'll get pulled right off. Getting steam messages, good thing I don't have them popping up. Uh, I'll have to check those in a little bit. Sorry about that, I forgot to turn it off. So far we're doing pretty good though. I thought that guy was getting saved, but he's not. I see the Wraith. Yeah, he's right over there to the right going back to that guy. Well, I think we already have enough to pip up, so that's a win on Sheltered Woods. I'm really glad I saved that guy. I'm really glad he didn't get me killed. I was going to be really sad. Uh, fortunately for me, the Wraith basically juked himself out. Alright, I'm going to try to run this guy away. I'm going to take a hit here. Hopefully my other teammate gets saved. Alright, we juked him out. Uh oh, uh oh, oh, we're bad. That's why you gotta be careful and look both ways when you cross the road. No one bothered saving that guy, unfortunately. That's very fortunate. Yeah, I gotta get him to destroy the plank so I can gain some distance on him to get to the next plank, basically. Unfortunately, I do not have adrenaline. No plank was there. That's what I thought. He was gonna go around. Sprint burst! Hopefully my teammates can get the last generator. Or I can get away. You know, both things are really good. I wanna run away from all generators possible. As well as hooks. Basement's on the other side. I think we're good. I think we lost him. Oh, sprint burst. Oh, that's a generator. Oh, like we got a teammate doing nothing while I'm being chased. This is the problem with playing with always oh, the only other teammate in the game. Yeah, this is the problem playing with uh, lower ranks. They don't do anything. Like other rank ones would have finished that by now, um, and have already opened the door. Yeah, I ain't gonna do anything because you're AFK. If you don't want to do anything, I don't have to. Yep, yep. You go that way. You go do that generator, Jake. Oh, okay. Rant's coming. That was close. Good thing I thought he'd come through there. He's also on stealth, which is weird. Oh, good. He's getting my other useless teammate, which is fine with me. I'm surprised some of these people were higher ranks. Like, uh, not higher ranks. I mean, they weren't rank 20, but I guess considering they made it so you don't lose pips on 7 to 10k, you got more people, I guess, in the ranks between. I wonder if he has Iron Grasp or anything. He might not be able to carry this guy far, far enough, because I think I've destroyed all the hooks around here. We'll have to find out.
I'm looking for. Yeah, I'm gonna leave that guy to die. Taking it slow. Now we go fast. It's pretty obvious. Ooh. Let's get rid of this hook. Yeah, we 100% have already pimped up this game, so that's a good sign. Um, I can't rescue that because I'm assuming this race is going to camp him the whole time. Uh, either that or he's going to patrol, and he's by two of the generators. There's one there, and there's one over slightly. The best thing for me to do is to play the hatch game, because this guy might have no escape step. I don't know what level he is. So, um, I'm just destroying hooks now, because if, if he ever decides to pick my teammate back up to try and give him more EXP, um, he's not going to be successful. So that's that. I don't think I can save him though. I don't. E I, I don't even think I can finish the last generator. I think I gotta play the hatch game. Oh, the hatch is already spawned. I could look for it actually. Look for it around here. Um, if you don't know, the hatch spawns with a total of uh, the amount of survivors killed plus generators finished equal five. So currently we have four generators finished and two people dead. So it's great or greater than five. So we're at six. So, the hatch should be spawned. However, oh, I knew it. It, it spawns around here. I've had this one location uh, twice before, so I thought I should come check it out. It looks like I was right. So, we're going to have to hide around here. Um, and hope to God that he doesn't know where the hatch location is or doesn't go searching for it. Um, I think spawn chill is going to be a great help here. I still think he's camping that guy laying on the ground. We'll easily know once spine chill goes off, though, or if I hear him. Did I just see it? No, I think that was a leaf. Yeah, it was just a leaf. Fun and interactive gameplay right here. I know the race invisible right now because his uh, he was last invisible. He went invisible on top of that guy. Is that a generator right over there? No, those are just twigs. Yeah, the generator's right in front of me. I don't want to sit still too long because crows will spawn above me. Which is really, really, really bad. Oh, he's going on stealth. That he's gonna try picking him up now. Oh no! Oh god, that lag! It's probably because it's rendering such far distances. Also finished. I don't want to deter too far away from the hatch. As I was saying, he is still being camped. He's about to bleed out here though, which is good. I hope he does not crawl closer to me, because the closer he gets, the closer the wraith is. Oh, and the wraith's coming. He knows I'm here. Hi there. Oh, what the fuck? Okay. Well, that was easy. <laughs> I don't know why he did that. That was, that was not how you do that. Alright, cool. Well, successful game. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed. On that road to rank 1, it's not going to be very hard. Did we double pit that game? We might have. I don't think my altruism was high enough. Nope. No, oh, wait, no, I want to go back to the beginning. Yeah, altruism and objective weren't high enough. But we still got 22k points, so that was really good. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and have a good one. Bye-bye.